well, I'm trying to hit a 20. I'm practicing hitting the 20. I've just thrown five darts. I don't know if you can see them or not, but I didn't hit 20 one time. I got a bullseye, but I didn't hit a 20. So, you know, what's, what's the probability that I'll ever hit a 20? Is there some way I can figure that? Well, I, I see that there are, there are 20 different spots around here. So is my probability just one out of 20 that I'll hit a 20? Well, gee, if I was throwing at random, yeah, it'd be one out of 20. But I'm not throwing at random. I'm trying to hit the 20. So my probability of hitting it should be based more on my skill level than just the randomness of the numbers. So, how can I figure the probability that I'll hit a 20? Well, I just threw five and didn't get it at all then. What I thought I'd do is throw 15 more and see how many I get out of the five plus the 15 out of 20 altogether. So let me try that. I think I did a couple this time. I don't know, again, I don't know if you can see, but yeah, here's the 20 and here's the 20. So far, I've got two. I've thrown 10 all together, okay? Uh, I don't think tell. This one right here, that's a 20. The other four aren't. Take them out. Okay, so so far I've gotten three out of the 15. Oh, I did pretty good that time. Okay, so I've got one, two, three more. So that's a total of six out of the 20 throws, six of them. So that's the fraction six over 20, six twentieths, which reduces to three tenths. So I guess at, at my skill level, I can expect to hit a 20 three out of every 10 times, or 30% of the time. Let's, let's take this up on the desk and take a look at it. 